Hello, it is Direct Mail Monday, July 6th, 2020. Steve Cypress here with a very simple but very powerful tip. Can put a lot of money in your pocket if you use this one. I talk about it all the time, but here's an example. It landed in my mailbox. Actually, it landed in my mom's mailbox. It's her name on the piece. Uh, even though she passed away a little over five years ago, I had her mail forwarded here because I was the administrator of the estate uh, and uh, she got on a bunch of mailing lists as a senior uh, a senior woman and she also uh, had hearing aids so I receive a lot of stuff from hearing aid companies dressed my mom my mom received a lot of stuff uh, this one hit home with a classic powerful lesson that I see way too many people ignore, unfortunately, to their detriment. And now is not the time in this chaotic time to be ignoring uh, t tried and true rules that uh, give you a leg up on getting success. You can never guarantee that any ad or marketing piece or message or anything succeeds. But come on now, let's stack the deck in our favor while the, uh, uh, while the chaos is causing all kinds of problems. Uh, and so now's the time to do this one, and as always, this Direct Mail Monday tip applies to any way that you choose whatsoever to do your advertising, marketing, or sales, whether it's uh, through email or a business card or a brochure or a website, social media posts, direct mail, all the rules apply all the same, as you know if you're a regular watcher of Direct Mail Monday videos, other people think Oh, these are only about direct mail. They don't apply to anything else. And that'd be silly because I don't talk about surface or minor or shallow uh, 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 subjects like that. I talk about time-tested, true strategies, bedrock strategies that work. They've worked before. They work now. They'll always work because they're based on human behavioral psychology, which uh, does not change, as you can see from everything going on these days it's nothing different and there's there's no different way to effectively motivate motivate um, sell influence persuade manipulate whatever you want to call it people it always works the same one way is to speak to your target market uh, in the way they want to be spoken to, not necessarily the way you want to speak to them. And here's a great example of this. This is a piece uh, mailed to a senior woman, and the one photo on it is of a senior woman, including pink dumbbells, pink shirt, pink workout ball. Uh, the theme is this is about empowered women powerful senior woman and the message of hearing aids is just that to empower yourself to have independence to not have to rely on somebody else to tell you what was that what'd you say or to not be able to do things or not be able to go places because you just can't hear properly uh, you want to really be independent you want to be able to hear and a hearing aid uh, helps you do that so here is a photo of a strong uh, just her in the photo, no man, no other woman, so the message is sent that it's independent. This is a strong, independent woman. Now, here's how this works in all of your advertising, marketing, and sales. You use different photos when you're talking to different who's. That's the wow strategy. The first letter of the wow strategy is the who, the ideal target who that you would like to do business with you. In this case, this hearing aid company would like my mom, if she were alive today, she would be a strong, senior, independent woman. And they would like her to give them money. They're going to show a photo of someone who she either aspires to or feels just like her, but there's not going to be a disconnect between the photo and the rest of the message. Now, if uh, this was to a senior man, it would be a photo of a man. And from the looks of it, they would include the color blue on the shirt and the dumbbells and the, the medicine ball, the, uh, the workout ball. Uh, and it would show an, an elder, uh, senior, 
strong, confident, independent man. They would target the man. If they are going, not a hearing aid company, but if you are going after a younger demographic, say, uh, you know, working moms, then you want to show uh, whatever age group you're looking at. A working mom with young kids, usually someone uh, in the 30s, and might have a couple of young kids in the photo, and might even be in the car, being on the go. Uh, so anyway, enough said, you can figure out the rest. Uh, you want to carry different versions of your business card, different versions of your brochure, have different, put up four or five different websites, have four or five, six different postcards and mailers made up and run all different ads. You know, when I, people might know, I spent three and a, a little over three years with a yellow page publisher, and the sharp advertisers that followed this strategy and made the most money, same as today, even though that was 15 years ago, it still works today, and even though that was the yellow pages again. Works with direct mail, works with a website, works with a business card, works with an email, a social media post, works with everything. The smartest advertisers ran multiple ads in the same heading. So a plumber would have an ad with a woman like this in it and would have a message to senior women, which is a different message, a different reason, different things they're looking for and different things they don't like when they call a plumber than young men. So they would have an ad that appeals to the young men, something like, uh, you know, we guarantee you'll be there fast. We're the fastest plumber. Uh, but the senior woman, uh, likely to be more uh, interested in and more um, influenced by safety. So it would say all of our plumbers are drug tested and screened, carefully screened, and we guarantee that you'll be safe. And we send them out in pairs so that they're, you know, or, or there's a woman. We send around a woman plumber. You know, boom. So, anyway, we go on and on, but I think you get the point. The WOW strategy is all about marketing, advertising, sales, the messaging to your ideal target who. And the last W is the way that you get your message, or the middle letter being the irresistible offer, the O, the way you get your irresistible offer in front of your ideal target who. Simple as that. That's the WOW strategy. Get those things right. And your advertising, marketing, and sales efforts will pay off many, many, many times. And you, too, will feel like a million bucks because you'll have a million bucks in your bank account when you use direct mail and any other way of advertising, marketing, and sales properly and most effectively. And now it's not the time to be wasting money. Now is the time to be doing things smart. So I hope you'll do that. I hope you'll go to ProfitFromChaos.com for some more help and some more tips on how to profit from this chaotic economy. We're opening, we're reopening, no, we're closing, we're reclosing. This is required, that's required, these are the rules, we change the rules. Man, if you want to navigate that all on your own, hats off and good luck to you and please share your success story. I hope you are wildly successful. But if you want to plug in to some help, meet some other people that are very successfully navigating these chaotic times, head over to ProfitFromChaos.com. See you there, and I'll catch you tomorrow on Topical Tuesday. Thanks for being here today. Over and out.